Have you ever wondered what Shrek characters would look like if they were in Mortal Kombat? No? Well, I have. And now it's your problem. Take it one step at a time. What's going on my dudes, One Step here. Yes, with Shrek characters in Mortal Kombat. Now, what do I mean by that? Well, first make sure you subscribe here for more content. And what I mean is I did two things. I asked AI, what would this Shrek character look like if they were in Mortal Kombat? And two, I done did some Photoshop myself. So that way we have two different versions of what X Shrek character would look like in Mortal Kombat. I know you're just itching to see it. You saw that thumbnail, so let's get right into it. Yeah, firstly, that thumbnail, that was Shrek, dude. This picture is ap it's, just, it's it's gorgeous. It's beautiful. I of course added the scorpion kind of ninja mask to it to make it more like Mortal Kombat s. But dude, either way, imagine another one comes out like yeah, we we have Omni Man, we have Homelander. Now we get Shrek. Oh my gosh! If you want to sell millions, that's how you do it. Now I couldn't do every single Mortal Kombat character. I couldn't do every single Shrek character. But now I asked AI what would Princess Fiona look like in Mortal Kombat, and this is what they gave me. And I'm not gonna lie to you, it's actually pretty fire. Like if they added this in Mortal Kombat, they did like a, a Shrek combat pack DLC. We already got Shrek, now we're getting Princess Fiona like this. Oh yeah, I'm buying it. So that's the AI version. What did I Photoshop? Well, I Photoshopped Fiona onto Katana. And I think it also fits. I think both of these renditions are actually pretty cool. Like Fiona's already a princess. So she fits the princess as like, you know, with Melina, with Katana. And and this vibe right here, it kind of just, it kind of just fits. So we got Shrek, we got Fiona. Who's next? Donkey's next. So I asked AI, yo, what would Donkey from Shrek look like if they were a Mortal Kombat fighter? And oh my God gosh this I, I don't even know what to say i don't even know what to say it's beautiful it's gorgeous i could see it being a shrek crossover but i could also see it being a standard you know like standalone mortal kombat character dude I, I would play this character in a heartbeat. Like we got animal-esque characters. We got we got Reptile, Shao's kind of a half dragon looking guy. Give us Donkey. I personally photoshopped Donkey onto Johnny Cage because they're both smart asses. So it just made the most sense to put Donkey on Johnny Cage. It just kind of fits. Like just the whole like, <laughs> making jokes and doing dumb shit. Yeah, this this just fits too, I think. I don't know. I do love the idea of like a giant muscular beat em up Donkey, but this is pretty cool too. Then I asked AI, to give me what would Lord Farquaad look like if he was a Mortal Kombat fighter and this I don't know I don't know what to do about it I think it's freaking amazing like imagine they just put him in like a Mortal Kombat game like yeah this is Farquaad he just walks out like all jacked and like let's go some of you may die but that's a risk I'm willing to take. Like, it's, it's just it's just amazing. What I did, I thought Havoc's hair looked pretty, you know, the black and the coming down. So I put Havoc onto Lord Farquaad and I'm not mad about it either. I'm really, I think it's, I think it's great. I do like the idea of like a super six foot three jacked Lord Farquaad, but I also don't mind Lord Havoc quad. This next one's gonna be a bit strange because then I asked, okay, what would, what would Fairy Godmother look like as a Mortal Kombat character? And it spat out this and I was like, whoa, that, Super interesting. I mean, I could see it. Like she's best friends with Madame Bo for sure. And she'll slice you up without a second thought, but then she'll bake you the best cookies you ever did have. I don't know, fairy godmother, long black, white hair. I also thought of Sindel, so I put Sindel's head. I mean, fairy godmother has a really large head compared to her body anyway. So putting Sindel, it doesn't look too far off. I mean, I probably could have done better, but I do think that it looks pretty good. I think Sindel being fairy godmother in a Mortal Kombat Shrek crossover does make sense. This next one's probably one of my favorites. I wanted it to do the magic mirror from Shrek and I'm not gonna lie to you, AI gave me nothing. It just gave, it was just, it, there, I got no good photos from it. So I decided to take charge and Photoshop it myself right from the get go. And I thought, duh, Shang Tsung just fits the magic mirror. They have the same drawing voice. I feel like Shang Tsung would be like, hmm, who's the prettiest in the land? I am the prettiest in the land. Oh, quiet. Don't don't even talk to me. So yeah, Shang Tsung being the magic mirror totally fits. Oh, don't worry. We're not done yet. We got dragon. Obviously, we got to do dragon. And there's probably only one character that really fits this theme. And yeah, that's General Xiao. Dude, he's already kind of a half dragon looking guy anyways with the horns, with the scales, with the eyes, the teeth. It it's 
it's just too perfect like now 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 i have to have dlc that's dragon but then it's general this is all different timeline by the way so this is just the shrek timeline this is all this is this is still mortal kombat we saw some whack characters at the end of mortal kombat spoiler alert and and now we're now this is just another timeline that's all this is so yeah general shall be in dragon it just mwah beautiful it just fits but this is what ai gave me as dragon being a mortal kombat character and it's just a dragon so that's why i took charge and did the photoshop with shao and dragon i think i prefer the shao as dragon honestly then we have prince charming this is what ai gave me as prince charming being a mortal kombat fighter and it's not bad at, but it does look pretty generic like oh yeah that's just like a a prince just some kind of generic warrior looking dude it's not terrible but i think that Liu kang being prince charming is just a bit Bit better i mean we got the locks we got i am the fire god he he's he's arrogant but also humble but again it's just a new timeline so Liu kang being prentice charming yeah trust me baby i am the protector of earth realm don't worry i'll take care of you i'm the keeper of time do you know who you're talking to i am the god of fire oh yeah yep yeah, absolutely 100 percent that's why it makes so much sense as fiona being katana with that crossover as well now we're all just connecting the pieces you know what i'm saying i thought this Shrek roster as Mortal Kombat fighters with AI and my own photoshops was great but there's one honorable mention I could not for the life of me think of a good photoshop edit so maybe it was just like I brain farted but the one character that I really wanted to see as a Mortal Kombat fighter was of course Jinji and this is what it spat out and oh my dude imagine they put the gingerbread man they just put Jinji they put gingerbread and he this guy walks on stage and is like do you know the muffin man <laughs> Like he's fighting, and he like, it's like a grappler, grabs you, throws you, the muffin man! <laughs> Uh, I just I love that. I think that would be just oh that was that 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 thought to me is just amazing. Which franchise are we making Mortal Kombat characters next? Let me know your thoughts down below. Who's your favorite Shrek combat character? Subscribe here for more fighting game content and take it one step at a time.